Yo, what's going on guys, DJS here, and we're back. This is the last one that I was going to post for the top 10. Uh, this is the number 6 most wanted race, the McLaren MP9465, or whatever it's called. Uh, here's an intro cut scene for that. Um, I love the McLarens. I think that was the F1, the original one that came out years ago. Uh, full bo body was carbon fiber, it was handmade, the, the car was just crazy nice. I think that was the first like million dollar uh, racing car that was in production that I, that I knew of uh, back in the day, but... Uh, so I imagine this this McLaren's uh, pretty darn expensive as well. This is the number six spot though. If you guys haven't seen the series so far, I have uh, the top five I posted a long time ago, and then I'm posting slowly ten through six. Um, I know I did it in backwards order, but I wanted to get the top five out for YouTube since I did get the game early. Compliments of Machinima. I got to post gameplay of the game a week early before the game actually came out. So now that the game is out, uh, everybody can kind of experience this uh, this game if you guys are interested in playing. I am racing it against uh, this uh, McLaren with the Marussia, which is one of the cars in the game that I've actually never seen before in, uh, in any magazines or anything like that. And um, some of my subscribers left some comments let me know uh, how much the car costs and all that stuff. But this car, to me, is just disgusting. It's so sick. It looks like the Batmobile, and it's really beefy. Uh, turn radius is great. The acceleration is great. Um, and you can see it's really, really strong. And it takes takes on a wall, even. Look at that. That was a nice little wreck. Um, yeah, I actually have some wreck montage, crash crash montages if you haven't seen my channel, um, if you want to check those out, as well as just uh, my, my opinion on the best car in the game and, and uh, other things like that. So lots of Need for Speed videos that I posted out there. Um, yeah, but I'm enjoying it and have, I was having a lot of fun playing the game. Uh, and you can see right here, the, uh, the dude is a little bit of ways ahead of me and we have about two miles left to go. So this is a shorter race. This corner was one of the hardest ones to take right there. Um, and I think that since I took that one so well, I was able to catch up a little bit because uh, he was kind of like, I don't know, taking these. This is a little bit of drifting right here around that corner. So kind of kind of cool. I really like the way that you can control the vehicles. And, and there's a nice little uh, launch right there. Um, and, I'm, and all of a sudden, I'm in the lead now with a mile left. So I'm in a good spot. This is, a, this is where you want to be at if you can. Um, you know, it wasn't that perfectly executed race, but it was good enough for myself that it got me the win. That was a nice little turn right there as well. That's a tough one to take, uh, drifting around that corner because it's a really hard turn. And then this is another really hard one right here. This is a, another spot where I was crashing a lot. Not right here and not when I turned left here, but when you're going, watch this right here. When you're going into these two spots, I was just crashing into the wall right there instead of uh, making my, my way into the tunnel. So that was a big pain. Once I, I mean, I played this a handful of times to actually win this one, uh, so I was happy that I was able to put on the juice right here at the end and, and solidify my victory right before he ended up uh, coming at me, but uh, ended up taking down the McLaren for the number six spot. Now I got to go ahead and ram him and uh, take his car from him, but hopefully you guys like this uh, series. If you guys did, give it a thumbs up. If you guys uh, want to see any other Need for Speed type of gameplays, uh, let me know. Leave a comment. Let me know. If you want to see any other games, let me know as well, but uh, most likely I will be posting any other games on my second channel, my Let's Play channel in the description if you want to subscribe to that one. I'll be doing like Assassin's Creed right now. I've been doing Mass Effect 3, did Medal of Honor campaign, uh, uh, Cabela's Dangerous uh, Hunts, which is the worst game of 2012, I said, which is, but I did a full walkthrough of that as well. So, playing lots of different games, having fun, and uh, just like to, to, to expand a little bit more than my uh, the normal Call of Duty kind of thing to do. So, again, hopefully, you guys uh, don't mind. Um, seeing other games other than Call of Duty, but my, my main channel, as soon as Black Ops 2 comes out, we're, we're coming real close here. As soon as it comes out, it's going to be all about uh, Black Ops 2, but so I think uh, the reason why I keep playing this one is because I get to the point where I actually go crash into him. Um, he, he evaded, but what happens if, if he evades you, if you just kind of wait around or if you crash into a wall or something, he'll come back and then you'll uh, he'll be able to, to hit him, so that's what I think ends up happening coming up here. Um, he just kind of ends up looking shows up in the middle of nowhere and then, then I, I was able to, to get the, the victory. See it right here. Uh, oh wait, I didn't even know how that happened. I didn't even see him and, and I ended up getting that one. Isn't that weird? Uh, anyway, have a good one guys and uh, we'll, we'll catch you guys for another vid uh, tomorrow. Thanks. All you can be advised, we need highway units detailed for this pursuit. Copy that, MDC update issued to all local units. Copy that, MDC update issued to all local units. 